In this Python nice GUI tutorial, we will make a web application using the input element. After entering the image file into the input element, the image is displayed on the screen when the button is clicked. In the video I will show step by step how to do the application. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video. First, I will create the input element. I am creating a variable. I send the label value to the input function. I save the code file and run it. I added the input object to the web page. Let's focus a little on the features of the input function. We can add a description using the placeholder feature. I am saving the code file. Description added to input object. If we need an input object for the password, we can use the password parameter. I set the password parameter to true. I am saving the code file. The entered values are not displayed. For now, I set the password value to false. I will create a button. I am creating a variable for the button. I am saving the code file. I added the button object to the web page. When the button is clicked, I want the image to be displayed on the screen according to the file name entered in the input object. I can do this using the onClick feature. I want a function to be called when the button is clicked. For now, I define the function with pass. I will create an image object. I create a variable for the image object. I adjust the size of the image. I will use these images in the application. You can access the images from the GitHub link in the description of the video. I will define the function. I can change the image using the set source function. I will send the data in the input object to the set source function. I set it to string. I can access the input object using the value function. I am saving the code file. After entering the image file into the input element, the image is displayed on the screen when the button is clicked. We can try different images. In this video, we learned how to use the input element. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video.